sports. It's in the game. Uh, the Bosphorus is very much part of the story here in Istanbul and we're on the European side of it at the home of Galatasaray. My name's Derek Ray and delighted to have alongside me as usual on these occasions Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is live action from the Turkish Superliga. It's Galatasaray and they take on Fenerbahce. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Well, Mesut Ozil can certainly pull the strings to wonderful effect. You'd rather fancy he'd have something to say for himself in this game, Stuart. Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-twos, little passes round the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. Here's how it looks for Galatasaray. Well, they're starting in a very solid 4-5-1, but they transition really quickly, and key to that are the wide players. They'll support the centre forward as soon as they win the ball back, and they usually do it with a lot of quality. Well, here's the starting 11 for Fenerbahce. Well, it looks like they're going to play in a 3-4-3 formation, but without wing-backs. So although they might have an overload in midfield, they will be vulnerable to any switches of play by the opposition. And now they get the ball rolling. Couldn't hang on to it. 
Kadioglu. Well, they have it again. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Well, a bit short with the clearance. Missing the target by a tiny margin. Well, it's a difficult skill to get right, but he almost pulled it off there. He made such good contact with the ball. Tisserand. Mihad Zeitz. Pelkas. Bright Osai Samuel. He's going forward well here. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Determined defending. Short corner routine. The delivery. Well, it might still work out for them. And relief as the keeper holds on. Well, he reacts so quickly, doesn't he? That's a great bit of work from him. And a throw-in it's going to be. Effective challenge. And in with a real chance. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. And he's lost custody of the ball here. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Well, the keeper's made a good save, but you just sense a goal is coming soon. Can they forge ahead? Oh, it's gone in! A derby goal, the first of the contest. Well, he puts it away really well, as you can see. But you'd expect him to score from that range. But they all count. And back underway, 1-0 it is. <laughs> Went in strongly, decisively. Breaking at pace. And intercepted it. There's a slide rule pass. And offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. Bright Osai Samuel. And teammates to play it to. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Opportunity it is. Oh dear, oh dear. The goal was at his mercy. Tame effort. Mihad Zaitz. And it's with Osai Samuel. Valencia. Well, they no longer have the ball.
Pelkas showing a lot of guile there could play it in well they want that equaliser but the passing remains smooth oh but they've lost it now well Galatasaray haven't been able to dominate possession but what they've done with it has been really good and they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment they love to play on the counter-attack might be a chance here and tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. The first half here comes to an end. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, it was certainly a good first 45 minutes for the lad. Obviously, he got his goal to put them in front, but he's looked lively throughout too. Hopefully, we see more of him in the second half. anticipated plenty of talking points so far and now the second half is underway and foxing the defender cutting in what can he do from this position Well, he needed to read it to get there, and did. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Ozil. Mihad Zaitz. Plenty of options, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. And it's played into the centre. Well, not the best clearance. Threat over for now, it seems. Ozil. Bright Osai Samuel. Options in the middle. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. But just like that, possession changes hands. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Pavo delivering it into the box. Now well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. Played over, and the danger still on. Well, nothing comes of it. Mihad Zaitz. Pelkas. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Oh, he's through here. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Has a go. And using his body to good effect. Well, they're so unlucky not to be level now. It was a great effort. You just wonder if they're going to regret that. And Anholt. On a crucial... And the referee's verdict is penalty kick. Well, no card, just a warning and a fair few protestations. Well, not every foul is a yellow card. I think the referee is right here. And with play stop, they will make the change now. A chance to extend the lead. Oh dear, oh dear, what was that? Well, I'm afraid, Derek, that was a woeful effort. What was he thinking?
Well, as we've seen, it's been all Fenerbahce in terms of possession, but it means nothing unless they start to be more creative, particularly in the wide areas. Up to this point, they've been too easy to defend against. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Kara. And reading it absolutely superbly. There's a slide rule pass. Irfan Can Kavecchi. Well, time is against them. They have work to do. And he did so well to move across and deal with the danger. Who can he pick out? Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Will it happen for them? Still possibilities. And couldn't keep himself onside. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. And so into the final five minutes. Giving the ball away. Bright Osai Samuel. Tremendous challenge. Well, great read there to intercept. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. Turan, and he's through here. And a goal to delight the fans, just what they were hoping for. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. Already no complaints whatsoever about his performance in this game, Stuart. Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today. with the clearance missing the target by a tiny margin well it's a difficult skill to get right but he almost pulled it off there he made such good con determined defending performing brilliantly well that's just incredible he reacted so quickly there oh dear oh dear what was that well i'm afraid derek that was a woeful effort what was he thinking to run and he's through here just what they were hoping for. 